Okay, so let's start using this program. Uh, programs, Autodesk, Autodesk Inventor, Autodesk Inventor Professional. Get rid of that. And it'll take a while to start up. Alright, so I'm going to just take you through some basic steps uh, to doing some things here. Uh, firstly, uh, we're going to do a, um, a box, uh, a bit like the GPS box I made for Ian. So we'll start with new, and I use standard, and then IPT, which is a 3D object. So start with this one, go OK. wait for a while so we start off with this drawing screen um, origin X Y and Z planes and X Y Z axes center point sketch so we're, we're in sketch mode now so it's going to be a pretty simple project going to start with a rectangle Draw a rectangle. Um, oh, I'll just cancel that. Something to check for. Uh, go into Tools and Document Settings and Sketch. And you'll see it's uh, in inches. So you have to uh, cancel out of there and go to this options here. And go to Sketch. And somewhere in here we'll say Dimensions. Snap to grid, that's checked on, which is good. Okay. I just checked it's still recording. Okay. Uh, close and go back to there. Units and put millimeters apply and then over here and usually you have to um, actually quit from close that file and then reopen it for some reason oh uh, yeah so we should save changes uh, yep yeah, okay save it and give it a name for example, Simon and today's date 201108 and date is 24th 24 save so now let's go and open that again open here's the file open and if you go back to here document settings units should be millimeters yeah, you just have to do that. So snap spacing, we'll change it to um, uh, usually one millimeter is good enough. But um, yeah, we can put for one millimeter for now. Uh, Go display two snaps per minor. We'll, we'll just uh, put one, and the major is ten. So every ten millimeters is a thicker line. Apply, close. Now all the grid's gone, so we have to go back to sketch mode model create sketch 2d sketch and then you got to pick the plane that you want to sketch on so we'll start with XY plane and draws up the grid there you can orientate the drawing to that plane uh, click over here XY there now um, I'll drag that starting point down to here and I'll just save this recording for the next one. Uh, stop F9.